today we're here with Annette Azuma, director here at Staples Broadway Accountants. Annette, thank you very much for your time and coming to talk to us today. Now, to kick this interview off, could you summarise your job in a few words? First of all, I'd like to say I'm very lucky um, in dealing with some wonderful clients. Um, as you've said, I deal with quite a lot of listed Japanese companies, unlisted Japanese companies and high net worth individuals who have immigrated to New Zealand. So 95% of my time is spent dealing with Japanese clients and I have three native Japanese speakers who also work with me alongside um, a team. We have about 110 people in our firm so they also assist on certain aspects. And my key role is dealing with the clients, knowing exactly what they need and making sure that we deliver to them and our motto for all of this is to provide great service. Do you think those relationships you mentioned are vastly improved by speaking fluent Japanese? Yes, I do think having the ability to speak Japanese is a really big plus. Meeting with Japanese people because I speak reasonably fluent Japanese within a couple of minutes, I will have developed an affinity with them. I think um, success in the Japanese market is not only Japanese language, it is also an understanding of the culture and building up trust. Did having Japanese on your CV, um, having taken it in university, did that help you get your first job? My, I did a double degree, so an accounting commerce degree as well as a Japanese degree. Initially, um, my jobs were always separate. Later in my career, um, realised the power of having the Japanese language and realised the powerful combination of Japanese and business experience and so it has now become you know a really great asset for me. The road to partnership in a you know quite a large accounting firm has been it's definitely been a plus. Okay one final question or uh, I'm gonna throw a bit of a scenario at you here. So you're stuck in an elevator for two minutes with um, a parent and their high school student. The um, course advisor is telling the student that they need to um, drop Japanese in favour of a uh, core subject like English, Maths or Science. What do you say to that child and their parent? I say to them, um, I would definitely keep doing Japanese, I think having something that not everyone else has is a really um, big plus for you in your future career. Learning Japanese, it's you also learn to think more outside the square. Mm. It actually gives you a cultural understanding of other people. You learn more about the country, so you become a lot more global in your thinking. And I think New Zealand does need more globally focused young people.